The pandemic changed a lot for everyone, but one Harlingen woman took the time she had to bake up an idea. She started a home bakery. That's right, but this bakery has a twist. It's for dogs and cats. Paw Paw Barkery and Meowery <laughs> is this week's Made in the 956. Samantha Mendoza was in vet tech school, but when COVID hit, that plan had to go on pause. And when the pandemic forced everything to close, it opened up an idea for Samantha. I just started and I was just like, just told my boyfriend, I was like, I'm going to start a dog bakery. And he's like, okay, we'll do it. And that's how it started, so. And it turned into this, Paw Paw Barkery and Meowery with one main focus. Having something more healthier for um, the dogs to eat other than had giving them chemicals and preservatives. Samantha gets the word out about her business through social media and word of mouth. She also hits up lots of local markets. I started off with cakes and then I slowly started doing treats and I believe like a year, a year ago, I just started doing markets for the treats. And these treats are made with more than just love. All my ingredients are on natural and human grade. So if you want to try them, you can. Everybody loves seeing all the hand decorated treats, the human inspired bakery treats for the dogs as of like the conchas and stuff. So with the flavors, I do have several flavors. I want to say I have like about 10 or maybe a little bit less than that. And they go from uh, sweet and I do have several savory flavors. So. With chicken and apple, I have that for savory, but I do have a lot of peanut butter flavors. Samantha also makes treats for cats. So with the cat treats are, um, I only have a few options available as a flavor wise, so, but I don't have decorated treats just because I was saying that you can't really give cats uh, dairy. I am working on getting cat, cat cakes out for the birthday. And she's hoping to expand beyond just treats. I am looking into building a website to ship treats nationwide and then hopefully one day have a storefront which would be with everything technically everything not just my bakery it would be like bakery doggy daycare boarding hopefully training i just i just want to everything big so something we're sure her four-legged customers are really going to enjoy like luca this is the cake she made for him the day we went to shoot this story and from the looks of it we think it's safe to say that luca is one satisfied customer paul paul barkery and meowery made in the 956 i mean the name alone of the bakery makes me want to be like just take my money isn't it so cute <laughs> it's so adorable cute. and you know what for the record sandra always gets mad at me when i go on my shoots and i don't bring something Never back for anything. her so i brought something back for you today you can tell Mickey those are from Uncle Trey. Oh my goodness. So there's goodness. Some, some treats that she gave me to try out, and these are actually real. I actually tried them. Were they good? They're actually really good. She's not lying. Like, you can I actually mean, eat they them. Look, and they, they look amazing. They look yeah. like actual, you know, Little cupcakes. human treats. No, yeah. And just something important to note also, and a lot, a lot of people so talk about sometimes, oh, the prices of, of these and whatnot. Yeah. These are homemade. So when you go to a store, they're already expensive in a store, but stores have chemicals. They have things in there to mm -hmm. have them a longer shelf life. This is all natural. It's good for your baby, and they're worth the money. So why not? And they look delicious, and they're going to make your baby happy, so They are. And if, you, if you want to hit her up, also find her on Instagram at Paw Paw Barkery. She takes all her orders through Instagram and Facebook, so you can find her on there to place your orders. I know where I'm getting my birthday cake. Well, for my dog, at least. You can, get, you can eat it, too, though. <laughs> <laughs> Win-win. Exactly.